What's up, Internet? Corey Zamer here, back with the Final Fantasy Tactics subscriber playthrough. We did not have an extra power sleeve, so uh, unfortunately Kevin's attack power is going to be down a little bit. He was at 16, now he's at 14, but he does have a little bit extra HP. We're going into the next battle. Hopefully it's not against any Divine Knights, because I just realized I did not equip maintenance on anybody. I didn't do it. It's a thing I didn't do. Onward with two squads. Um, going to split them up like so. I actually don't know what the best formation is for this next battle. But this is our first battle in Murun Death City. Let's see what's going on. Alright. I don't remember your name, dude. It's Clayton. So, Rofel's been defeated. Then, unless I can defeat you here, I can't face Rofel. Come on. What? Then, unless I defeat you here, I can't face Rofel. What? This man's speaking gibberish. We got some ninjas, some samurai. Ah, oh, and I think I put... The guys that I needed in this group over on that group. But let's see how we fare against ninjas. Not something we actually fight very often. He's going to throw a rune, a rune blade at us. Reeves the ninja. The Agra Darkness. Can we run up on Clayton and kill him in turn one? Is that a thing? He's going to miss, and he's going to miss. That's unfortunate. A time mage is using charge in chapter 4. Way to float, I guess. What the fuck? Alright, so we very specifically need something that's not going to hit Ryan, because Ryan's already hit. And this hits no one else but Ryan. This doesn't hit when we need it to hit. This hits a ninja. So it's Cory, which is good. Samurai. This might be what I'm going to with. Let's see what Experience 5 does. This one hits Clayton and a ninja. So we're going to go with this one since we do just have to defeat Clayton. So we're going to blast him with a holy. Let's see how much this does. 131, that's about a third of his HP. I'm just gonna move him back, because he doesn't really need to be up in the combat at all. Oh, he's gonna put Shell and Protect on everybody, that's unfucking fortunate. Auto push it up back to full. Oh, sweet. Can we get over there? Oh, you fucker! That's okay. Should still be able to earth slash everybody. Earth Zinger running through my arms. Earth slash. Ooh. Ooh, his magical attack went up. That's not good for, for him at all. Because he's already pretty beefy with the magical attack. We'll run over here. And draw out. 
would like to get some aggro on Ronnie just because he's going to be very hard to hit and very tanky. I'd rather him be attacked by uh, Clayton than Kevin. Alright, so what are we looking at for charge times here? So charge 2 is going off. It's going to hit him. Holy is going to hit Kevin for possibly lethal. This would happen after that. And I wouldn't be able to hit everybody with that self. So. Huh. Kind of at a loss on what to do with Ryan here. Maybe Golem's the best move for a Carbuncle. Which one's the one that does the... Yeah, let's do, let's do Golem and run back. Out of range. Really? You connected with that? But again, I'm, I'm glad that that connected before the Golem took place. I don't want to waste Golem on a charge to attack from a Time Mage on my main character. Seems like a waste. Pure light, shine on bloody impurity, holy. I don't like to see holy against me. Especially when it's going to do more damage than mine. Ooh. If Kevin didn't have his new abilities, or his new, uh, his new armor, that actually would have taken him out. Dodging ninja stars left and right. Where's Vormav? Where did he go? Where? What an odd thing to say. We came to Death City to revive our master. He slumbers in this world in complete parts. Ormev is headed to the master's resting place, where St. Ajor died. Where is that? Where? You'll have to defeat me to find out. Oh my god! Why do they all say that shit? You'll have to defeat me to find out. Technically, the last guy that said that didn't spill any beans afterwards. He just peaced out. So I don't trust you motherfuckers. You'll have to defeat me to find out. Kiss my ass. Die. Die a death. Fucking Clayton ass, lying ass motherfucker. Are you gonna tell me where he is? No, you're gonna die. Oh, f forgive me, Roful. Are you guys a couple? Not that there's anything wrong with that, but you seem really concerned about Roful and what he thinks of you. Just saying. Over there? He didn't tell me that. I could have figured that out on my own. Lion ass Clayton. Eat dirt. Shit. We're out of here in under 10 minutes. I like that. An obscene amount of gill. Nowhere to spend it. Thank you. Thank you, game. Finally paying up. That's going to do it for this episode of the Final Fantasy Tactics subscriber playthrough. Maybe I'll have calmed down by the next episode. Maybe not. Who knows? Like the video, subscribe if you're new, and as always, keep it real, internet. I love you guys.